Once you get a few apps on your smartphone or tablet, you'll start to realize that developers update them reasonably often. This is because they discover from their adoring public that there are some bugs that need fixing, and they will occasionally fix those. Let's go to Play Store and have a look at this update process. We can check if any of our apps need updating by going into My Apps, which is the apps that we've downloaded, and we'll see that here we have three that are waiting for an update, and there's two that have been recently updated, and there's 122 that are installed and uh, may have been updated at some earlier time. Let's have a look at one of these to show you something. We're going to go into here, and we could update it, but I want to show you a setting. And if we click on our little menu button up here, we'll see this thing called Auto Update. Auto Update is pretty straightforward. If you tick that, it will mean that when the app is due for an update, it doesn't need to ask you. It just goes ahead and does it. And that certainly removes a lot of the um, problems from uh, you having to go in and authorize that update. So I'm going to click that update like that so that when I have a look at the settings for this one, it now has auto update. If I go back to the list that I've got there, and I've got three on there, what I can do is just select update all in this particular scenario, and it will set about doing exactly that. Um, and it, it might take quite a while because you see they're starting to download things like that and install. So it goes through two procedures, one download, install, and then once that's finished, see it goes off the list. And there are others uh, now doing the same procedure. So be prepared to um, deal with updates on your apps and you've got the choice of auto-update or not.